Alrighty guys, welcome aboard the Skyway. My name is Maya, taking you over to the A station. That bar's floor in the middle has gone clear, so let's have a look down. Looking over to the right hand side, out into the valley there, what you can see is less than 2% of the Greater Blue Mountains. Here we have over 10,000 square kilometers of national parks, not including all of our residential areas. That big flat top mountain in the middle is Mount Solitary. Come walk out there, camp on the top. Base of it is larger than the base of all the room, and also marks the end of the Jefferson Valley, which is the pocket of forest we're coming over now. To the front right corner, we have the beautiful Three Sisters. Those girls from World Heritage listed in the year 2000 as they're very important to our local Indigenous people, the Gunningara and Dara tribes. Before then, you were able to rock them and have a sail down them. The closest get to them is the Room 3, and the first is self connected to the rest of the cliff face. As we are about to go over our highest point of the trip, the double the height of the Sydney Harbour Bridge, and over to the left, Kitubu Waterfall. It's not the most impressive waterfall in the world, but it's fed by a hanging swamp, never been recorded dry, and that water slowly makes its way through the valley, behind Mount Solitary, and into Warwick Air Dam, Sydney's drinking water supply. And the reason we're called the Blue Mountains is because of all of our eucalyptus trees. So when the sun hits those leaves, all the oils in them start to evaporate, mixed with light and dust particles, gives us that beautiful blue haze, called the Rayleigh scattering effect. Okay, sorry.